Oh, welcome once again. Gonna do a little starter for you new guys and starting the tutorial. Now, starting the tutorial is here under Hunt Now and you go down to Tutorial. You should get this, this little thing here and you should be able to start your recording. Okay, just let me move this out the way because this is my OBS. I'm going to put it on that screen there and I'm going to start the tutorial. So here we go. We'll start the game. Hopefully that will be starting now. And this will launch into the game like you would do if you were going to go and hunt. So here we go. There's the intro melody. And then it will take us into the game. And then it will tell you a brief description from Doc. And he's going to teach you about uh, hunting the whitetail. Uh, I wish this was in um, audio. Uh, and the audio read this out to you. Because people like me who have got a visual handicap. This writing is a little bit too small. Uh, I can read it, but for me, uh, for other people, it might be it might be too small. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to push the OK button after reading all that information. So I'm going to push the OK button. So it's loaded my weapon, and here comes the animal now. And as I say, this is the two two three, and this is not ethical. What we're going to do is we're going to shoot it like he tells us, tells us to. And there you go. And there will be a thing coming up on the screen um, that I've used the wrong weapon. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, and we're going to go back to the lodge and we are going to gear up with the right equipment. So without further ado, after reading, I'll leave that on the screen. We go back to the lodge and we gear up with the right equipment. So there you go. And it's as if by magic it's going to take us back to the lodge. And then it will tell us that we're going to go into our backpack. And blah, 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 blah. And we're going to gear up with the 243, which is ethical for the white cell. So as I say, I wish this was in. I wish this was in audio. Um, so I'm going to push, oh, push. I'm going to push OK, uh, and then I'm going to go into my backpack, push in the I key for the inventory, and then I'm going to take this weapon out, and I'm going to put in the 243, and I'm going to put in the appropriate ammo, and I'm going to put in the scope like it tells you in the tutorial, and then I'm going to check all my other equipment. Um, well, this equipment will come open to you or you can actually grind to get that other equipment open uh, like your sidearm and like a secondary weapon um, so without further ado we're gonna, gonna put that in there and it's gonna load the weapon and then it's gonna say head uh, let's head out on a hunt so you can actually, there's a, there is an, a firing range over here. And I tell you what, we're not going to head out on a hunt like it wants it to. I'm going to go over to the firing range. So we go over to the firing range. It tells you WASD, move back left and right. And we're going to go over here. And we're going we're gonna to fire off a few rounds. So... If you are testing other weapons which are not replenishable, you can come to this place here. There is also, over there, there is a um, shotgun range with clay pigeons. Uh, and you push the F key to launch a um, clay pigeon. And you can shoot it. And you can practice there. So hold the space bar. And there you go. And it tells you in the right hand corner that I've done it from 15 meters and I've hit the bullseye, which is 10 points. So I'm going to go over here. I'm going to go over to the end one actually. 
and there is a target over here as well there's an actual um, there is a target here so you can actually there you go now I got the bullseye and I got that from 22 meters and I got 10 points so basically so then we're gonna go for the far one far away this scope is not zoomable which is a bit of a magoo and there you go uh, 36 meters and I hit it and I got 10 points so I've got bullseyes with all of them so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna push the tab key like it tells me to do and then I'm gonna head over here and we're going to go out and we're going to go and track a white tail. Whoop whoop. So there you go. So let's go over here. Um, this tutorial doesn't tell you and doesn't touch on uh, the scent eliminator uh, and things like that. Yeah, you've got to take all that into a, into a, into a, a factor because if an animal smells you, uh, it will leg it and you're going to go well why did it run away uh, because you've got to use sin let scent eliminator so we're going to go here and then we're going to travel here to this little place and then it tells you about all the information on the screen blah 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 blah, blah. it's just basically a, a little follow guide and a little tutorial a little taster to the game um if you come into my um twitch channel and i stream uh, I will can give you an up to date. You can ask me questions, and I will give you more information on what you've got here. And I will link it in the description below, as well as the YouTube channel and my Discord will be in the description as well. So, without further ado, read all the information on the screen. And I wish it was in audio. And I'm going to push OK. So this is down to basically this is your tracking. Now that first uh, dome there with the arrow pointing down at it, this is the first track. So we're going to go and collect it. And how to collect it is look down at it and your ID blink is blinking and you pick it up. And then you push the second mouse button which is the right click and you will go back. And you follow down the cones here this is the tracking cone so you can follow down here and there you go I've got another indication on the uh, on the screen and I got the birdies in the background so this is a second light that I will get on my hunter mate and the ID is blinking and I pick it up so there you go and then right click and it go back where and now I'm going to go down this cone to find the other track. Three lights on your hunter mate means you've tracked the animal successfully. So here's the other one, but there's no, there is no, you can actually change your um, tracking colour too. There's no, oh yes there is, it's just popped up now. I was going to say there's no arrow going whoop, 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 whoop. So here we go. This is poo. This is white tail poo. Uh, it doesn't it's very standard the information on the hunter mate but as you progress you will get more information on your hunter mate so what I'm going to do is now we've got a solid circle which means that at whitetail is in the close proximity of where we are so here we go we've got another an indication where we're going to head to because at the moment this white tail's roaming it's an entirely different kettle of fish when it's not roaming and it's fleeing or it's trotting so this is the next one so there you go and if as you can see on the hunter mate this circle has decreased so we're going to head over here going to head over here and we're going to try and find the other track I know where the track is because I've done this several times but we're going to find the other track like the uh, tutorial wants and I think this one is a bedding down track where the animal was sleeping so what I normally do when I'm 
getting very very close now to where the animal is I normally go in the crouch position but it will tell you to go in the crouch position in a minute but this is what I normally do so there you go this little circle here is a bedding track and it will tell us that the animal has bedded down here so there you go all those Z's on the hunter mate means that that animal is bedded down so here we go so this is all about positioning and posture now so I'm going to push the OK key because we're in the right posture because we're in the crouch but the game will tell us whether we are in the position it will tell us actually to go down into a prone by pushing the control key and then pushing the shift key to stand back up into a crouch and if you push the shift key again you'll stand up so we're going to go here and then we're going to do what it says it tells us to do I'm going to go now with the control key the um, left control key and I'm going to go in and into a prone position and then I'm going to stand up by pushing shift Will you not let me stand up no okay so there you go I've got a tick on that so there you go so I'm going to push the four key which is your bleater horrible thing it is Here we go, and it will tell us that the animal is going to come in, that little bobbing thing, and it's called, so I'm going to pick up the call, and it will give me a ping on my hunter mate where it estimates that animal will be. So here he comes, and I'm going to push the 5 key, which is my binoculars, to spot the animal. And spotting brings up your skill as well. So here we go, whop, whop, whop. So there you go, I've spotted it successfully. Species, white-tailed deer, gender, male. So then I'm going to push the number one key for my 243. And I'll let him get a little bit close. I'm going to let him go parallel to me. Yeah, 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 come parallel, pal. So that, bit, that really is a bad shot. I really want him to come facing um, parallel to me to shoot him so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into a prone and I don't know he might have seen me are you going to come in mate or not yeah whoop 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 here he comes I'm going to push the space bar to hold my breath Well, there you go. Successfully done. Push the tab key to put your your um, two, four, three away back into your backpack. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go and pick him up. Now, when you're actually hunting in real life, you will be able to taxidermy it if you've got a lodge, or you will can sell it. Um, it's not a bad one. This one actually. Look at the horns on this. My, 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 I'd like to, I'd like this tutorial to show you the rudiments of taking a trophy shot. And now, as I say, if you pop past my stream, I've got a load of information as well as on my Discord. So I'm going to, I'm going to pick him up as if I would do if I was going to take a trophy shot. And there you go, I got it smack in the heart. And I dropped him. And then I'm going to push resume. So there you go. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. There you go. And I ended up being good. Blah, blah, blah. All the information on the screen. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. And then it's basically going to say that this is the end of the tutorial. I'd like them to do a tutorial, actually, to show you guys how to do a trophy shot. But there you go. So, without further ado, I'm going to call it there, and I will catch you in the next one. 
And... Daddy bye! Daddy bye! Daddy bye!